guys, MGX for fun here with a, another pack opening. This time we're going to do Kaladesh and Aether Revolt. Um, I like these sets. Uh, I think they're kind of cool. I think it's kind of sad that um, one of Kaladesh's high value cards just kind of died because it got banned. But what are you going to do? Now I'm hoping to get an invention, maybe. That would be nice. I'm not going to hold my breath for it, but you never know. Torrential Gear Hulk would also be pretty nice. Actually, Torrential Gear Hulk would be very nice. I mean, most of the cards in this set are really, really nice. But I actually am looking for a Torrential Gear Hulk. Our first uncommon is Engineered Might. Our second uncommon is Blossoming Defenses. That's a good card. Um, our third uncommon is Elegant Edge Crafters, and our rare is Confiscation Coup. Oh, and a Nissa Emblem. That's nice. Uh, choose an artifact or creature. You get four energy, then you may pay any amount of energy equal to that permanence converted mana cost if you do gain control of it. That's not bad. Uh, we'll just do Kaladish first. I was going to kind of mix it up, but... Eh. Saheeli would be nice, too. Yeah, I I like the idea of this set, and honestly, the art in this set is some of the coolest art they've had in a long time. It's just really, really creative, I guess, is... Great word, like that. That's really cool. I mean, look at him. He's terrified, but... That's really cool, too. It's just so cool, all the constructs and the... The puzzle knots were a lot of fun to play with in Limited, too. Larger than life. That's a good card. Uh, our first uh, uncommon is Imperial Voyage, Voyager. Blah, 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 blah. Diabolic Tutor. Those are always nice to have. Start your engines, and our rare is... Gaunti, Lord of Luxury. So he's a 2-3 for 4 with Death Touch. When he enters the battlefield, look at the top 4 cards of target opponent's library. Exile one of them, exile one of them face down and put it the rest on the bottom of that library in a random order. For as long as that card remains exiled, you may cast it, and you may spend, ma spend mana as though it were a mana of any type to cast it. That is a wall of text, but that's really cool. Look at the servo. This is what I mean. The art in this set is really, really cool. Okay, now we'll move on to Aether Revolt. And we'll see what we can get here. So yeah, Oops, sorry. It's pretty cool. Um, I thought these sets were okay. I think Aether Revolt less so than Kaladesh as far as being good goes, but there's some there's some nice cards in either of all, and you just I just appreciate the art. Uh, our first in common is Invigorated Rampage. Our second is Perilous Predicament. Our third is Monstrous Onslaught, and our rare is Secret Salvage. Uh, I'll just hold that there f so you guys can see it. Um, Exile, target non-land card from your graveyard. Search your library for any number of cards with the same name as that card. Reveal them, put them into your hand, then shuffle your library. Not too bad. It's a decent card, and we got an energy token. Okay, and last one. Okay. Let's see what we can get. Hmm. Menace. What is that? You tap it and you get an energy? <gasps> Oh, oh, sorry. Our first uncommon is Gremlin Infestation. Second uncommon is Skyship Plunderer. Our third uncommon is Ridgegale Tusker. And our rare is... Gaunti's Aether Heart. Uh, when it... Gaunti's Aether Heart or another artifact enters the battlefield under your control, you get two energy. Pay... what is it? Two, four, six, eight energy. Exile Gaunti's Aether Heart. Take an extra turn after this one. 
That's pretty sweet. Huh. I'll take it. Not terrible. Poles weren't too bad, huh? What the? Get out of here. Nobody wants you. So, these are what we got. I'd say we did pretty well. Diabolic Tutor and Blossoming Defense. And Nissa Token. So if you enjoyed the video, don't forget to like, subscribe if you haven't already, and comment. It really gives me a sense that you like what I'm doing. And it's a way for me to interact with you guys. And if you haven't already, follow me on Twitter at MTG... MTG God. At MTG Decks for Fun. And like me on Facebook, MTG Decks for Fun. I just, uh, I actually just posted, I'm recording this on Thursday, the 1st of June. And I just posted spoilers from Hour of Devastation and from Commander 2017. So if you haven't seen those yet, you can go to my Twitter or Facebook. I posted both of them in both places. And check them out. Thanks for watching, guys.